welcome to raja sasila holistics today we will do a life path uh, session for uh, sagittarius this 2022 how the year will go it will cover all the 12 aspects pertaining to your chart so uh, 2022 basically as per numerology it is a combination of number 2 and number 6 which both are average for sagittarians um but if you are if even though it is average if you, you are a sagittarian and you are born on the dates 2 4 5 6 7 8 and 9th of the month uh, the series of these numbers it will be good for you for 1 and 3 it will be an average year uh, this year will be basically fairly good for those in artistic pursuits and uh, creative works and uh, fe- feminine products producers and all and uh, to enhance the best of this year i would recommend you to keep a rose quartz on your desktop or in your workplace or in your kitchen or in your living room wherever you want wherever you find you find uh, um, uh, negativity and wherever you find that you need some energy there you can so these are the places where you need to keep it so that you can get the best out of it before going into the reading we will quickly do a cleansing session for the cards because it will have the impression of previous readings what we have done to others so first we will do a energy healing to the cards so that they can clear off with their Uh, past memories attached to it one way of cleansing any way which uh, suits you which gives you satisfaction you can do now for sagittarians the year 2022 how it will be uh, various aspects in your life we will cover your love life your career life your health your relationship your loss your gains your spirituality your yeah, aim fulfillment like that all 12 spheres we will cover the first card for you is your general energy running throughout the year the second cards for sagittarians their career third card for them their love life two cards for you for your love life and uh, fourth card for you for your health fifth card for you for your relationship and sixth card for your finances seventh card for your travels eighth card for your wish fulfillment ninth card for your properties assets tenth card for your children eleventh card sudden loss and gains twelfth card your spirituality and uh, from another deck i am taking two more cards Uh, to tell how the year will go in one word another card tarot guidance and one angel guidance card first card describing your general energies two of pentacles there will be lot of material upheavals in your life Uh, prioritizing things and uh, trying to manage your finances to it will be the total limelight in this year you will be picking up many issues and managing and juggling between them 
so it can be your children's education your buying a property or such things where lot of money may be involved so you will be juggling between them and managing and trying to balancing it lot of confusions can also arise but at the end you will be managing it and in your career you have got the carton of wands so a lot of responsibilities to grow and a lot of work burden and work things are indicated in your work front career front or in your business you will have lot of orders coming in and you trying hard to fulfill them it uh, business will be uh, good there is no issues but you will work hard for it lot of work and your love life we have seen you have got two card you have got the card hanged man and temperance both the card giving you a similar message that there will be lot of issues you may not be happy with your current situation things are not that good and uh, but it says that you need to be under balance don't let your emotions override you you have to take control of it words should be uh, let off with care otherwise it may tell upon your relationship you should be careful you should think from a different perspective and uh, Uh, try to judge that's the thing and in your health you have got the card four of cups it says that you uh, be uh, because of stress or some other issues you are neglecting your health you have to keep your health your fitness regime your diet structure and also all any medication treatment you were undergoing that you should take care you shouldn't neglect you should take care of your health this card also denotes that you may also have some thought of some mental clarity being not there that may lead to some depression like thing if you are already a person of having some depression history in your medical history or you had undergone quite some time back you should take more care Uh, so those are the energies and in your uh, other relations other than your romantic relation other relations with your uh, in uh, with your cousins brothers mother father children and uh, neighbors at your workplace the card is magician if you put hard if you work hard it will be good otherwise their uh, attitude towards will be very positive you need to be positive with them you should reciprocate with them then the relation will go really well there is absolutely no issues regarding those relation in finances you have got the card eight of wands lot of finances inflow is indicated lot of money coming is indicated at the same time going away is also not ruled out you should be very careful money will come in a jiffy and it may also go in a jiffy so you should take care and also this card uh, represents that if you have any travels you will gain through your travels that's the card for you and travel card you have got the card 10 of cups good card uh, good time for you to go in vacation with children and family so that you can have some fun time that is also indicated and uh, for fulfillment you have got the card world after a long time your wishes are going to be fulfilled and uh, you will come out with flying colors all things which were paining you you were not able to fulfill now is the year that you can fulfill all of them and win over many things in your life and in your property you have got the sun card any gloominess in your property it was there from long time it will clear children can get inheritance from their parents if you are trying for it and uh, if uh, any uh, stagnation in your property matters that will go if you either you want to sell or buy it will help you in both the ways it can help you so those are the energies and uh, in your children case knight of wands is the card so little bit uh, 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 energies with uh, shows that there will be some uh, some heated arguments with your children they are not uh, up to the mark so you get irritated so this card guides you that you should be a little bit uh, calm and take decisions calm don't let off the words otherwise later on it may be problem in your relationship also you have got the card temperance you should be cool don't let off the words otherwise it will be a problem even though your relationship now it says that it may not be that good 
you need to be under balance because the children card also says that uh, your temper may go here and there because of their attitude so these three cards says that even though the relation especially with children if it's not good it it's uh, giving you a lot of issues it it gives you a lot of issues and the magician card for your general relation says you put good you will get good you should react positively not in hasty things so those are the energies guys for according to tarot your relations and your sudden gain and loss page of cups from long time any uh, investment you have done that you were not get, fixing that you, you will get a good news uh, from your shares or your property or something like that which can, which can give you real happiness such uh, this are uh, popping up news can come up to you so that you can really be happy and in your spirituality you have got the card five of cups so it says that you will become a little bit detached and uh, your uh, attitude towards spirituality will make you unhappy you are not happy somewhere inside you there is some confusion that makes you away from spirituality such energies are seen in one card when we have to see uh, what uh, the universe has to send you this year you have got the card judgment so this card says from long time anything was uh, denied from you you were not given the proper right you were in such a darkness that uh, things were not happening according to your will and wish that can happen this year the early this year will be a fetching year for you a year which can give you justice and what the tarot gives you the suggestion is seven of pentacles from long time what you were trying you were working hard that will be paid off to you it will come to you but you need to be a little bit more patient the year is a promising one by before the year ends all your wish will be fulfilled the world card also says that your wishes will be fulfilled but you need to be little patient the judgment card says that uh, your long term things which were denied from you will be given to you these two cards says that definitely the winning one and the success one is your side and the angel card for you opportunity to forgive so this card says somewhere inside you you are pained about some relationship something is not good something is not well you are not happy with your situation especially in your relationship so that makes that uh, says that you need to be balanced the angel card says that yeah uh, this is an opportunity to forgive someone who have hurt you not because they deserve it because you deserve peace you need to forgive them so that you can move forward so that there is no issues which is blocking you so those are the energies guys if you like our channel kindly like share and subscribe